In the United States of America, there are over 400,000 children in the foster care system. Foster parents play a critical role in helping children heal. Adopting a child from foster care is a great way to help a child while growing your family. Hearing about the foster care program, um, which was a pilot program for siblings here in Georgia, reuniting those siblings and giving them an opportunity to live together and finding their forever family was exciting to me. My sibling group had been split up for the past year, um, so they were actually coming from different cities and counties in Georgia. Chris 180 provides me the support and the resources that I need to help the guys um, educational goals be met. They allow me to participate in different trainings and um, they provide me the resources that I need um, for the kids and that's really important so that they get a quality education starting off so young. Chris 180 is really multifaceted so I can come to uh, essentially one location to receive all of my children's services whether it be counseling slash therapy, recreation, medication, I can do all of that in one building. Another challenge that we face is um, helping the children work through their um, trauma. We use the trauma-informed foster adoption model. So Chris 180 allows us the opportunity to use wraparound services for the children, um, to engage in trauma-informed therapy services, residential services in terms of living environments. I would recommend uh, Chris 180 to others who are considering fostering or adoption, um, primarily just because it's very open and diverse. So um, you essentially can find something here for everyone, something that's appropriate and you will feel accepted no matter your walk of life. You know, I grew up with a, having a very big family. I mean, I have five sisters, one brother, a bunch of nieces and nephews. And I knew for me as a, you know, at a very early age that I, I knew I wanted children. I mean, we're at a spot now where we can and we're very excited that we are going to adopt. I think the biggest support for us and for me, um, I grew up in the South and so um, I know there's challenges in the South with gay parents adopting, and so the biggest reason why we chose Chris 180 is because of that, is because of, you know, if we just went to the state, we may run into issues where the state, you know, a, a state worker doesn't want to issue a child to us because we're gay. For me, my brother was adopted. I have two younger brothers, so I always knew that adoption was one of those things where people did become a part of your family, so much so that my brother is so much like me that we can finish each other's sentences. So we did actually make a, a good many friends in the adoption class, and, and you do build a bond with them because you're taking the same track. You know, some people come to the adoption or the placement piece at different times, but you do build this bond with each other and you build a support system there as well. I think the greatest frustration was um, when we were putting together the paperwork. Should we go individually and then Rainey and then Lori be the second adoption parent or do we file together with that idea that we were gonna be rejected because this was before the Supreme Court ruling. That was very frustrating that the court still hadn't legitimized our relationship um, and we went in all in and the happiness was that by the time we reached court it was not an issue anymore because it was settled at the Supreme Court. And I think people don't realize how stressful that is for parents who are adopting. Where Chris 180 has actually been really supportive with us is any time, you know, we didn't know anything, how to, how, if there was a particular issue with defects or if we didn't know how to advocate for the kids, then we would call and get support that way. and. You know, sometimes just even when we got frustrated or downhearted about things, I, I, I'm sure I called and cried a few times because we needed that support. Every time something exciting happens with the kids, like I, we want to share it with Chris 180, our, our people there, because now I feel like we're part of this big family. So somebody had walked up to my partner and I on the street and said, so how has Chris 180 helped? you would hear me say, I'm a huge fan. The training is something I wish every single parent would go through, even if they're not adopting children. 
everything from safety, understanding the impact of trauma, um, talking about development of children. And it was a small degree of many, many hours of, of setting us up for success. So resources, the quality of the staff, and then the piece that I get choked up about um, that my partner and I talk about all the time, you know, Ashley's comment the other day to me was, they are so in, and it's amazing to watch people help families come together and take nights and weekends to help us build our family. If you have the desire to be an important part of changing the direction and life of one of these children or a sibling group, then contact us so that we can help you begin that journey today.